Hey everyone, and welcome back to another video. Uh, today we'll be speed painting, kind of. It's more like a exercise and or a tease. Uh, what's the word? I forgot. I forgot the word. Anyway, I'm drawing hands because that's it's smart. Because hands are hard, and I've been avoiding hands in some of my works. So. Doing a little study, that's the word it's looking for, a study on hands, uh, seemed like a good idea. And it turned out to be. Um, now, to start, I'll just explain my uh, process, how I did it. So, you take your hands in a pose, then you make a picture of it, then you have the picture next to your drawing place, then you draw the hand. Doesn't sound that hard, does it? I mean, it still is. Um, I mean, the, the process of doing that isn't hard at all, like what I just said, like every, anyone can do that. But why do I uh, make a picture of it? So nothing changes, like if you just keep your hand in one position, it'll eventually change bit by bit. And lightning might change if you, uh, if you fucking move one finger a little bit, you might create a different uh, shadow, which will mess you up in the long run. So you don't want to do that. So you want to actually tail, take still frames, so pictures. That's what I did, and some of them are better than others. I mean, more delicate poses that have more shadow look better generally because you can see more of the actual uh, freaking. Jeez, I should probably look up words before I start recording. Um, the outlay of the hands, so that it's not just one freaking flat surface, but that it's has actual texture. Uh, that's important. And I am still figuring out what to draw of the nails. Um, in the first couple of things, I tried doing the whole nails, and that looks just terrible, especially in the way I'm doing it, uh, since it's still basically a watered-down version of the hand. It's not realistic. It's a realistic pose. So don't take that uh, for the same thing. If I would draw a realistic hand, I would probably have to use color and have to do way more intricate stuff with the small lines and the little dots and whatnot, like a lot of more stuff. I just did the outline and making it look like the shape of a hand, which already on its own is hard. Don't underestimate it. Now, uh, I advise you to do this yourself because, Jesus Christ, man, hands in drawings, they're one of the big things I mess up at. And I mean, there's a lot of things, steps to mess up at. Anatomy, freaking, like the entire anatomy faces, uh, hides how to properly proportion a character like a lot of different things that are bad but hands i think we can all agree are hard so try it out uh just take a couple of pictures of your hands in different poses you think are cool you think you might use and draw them just take your time i took like for all the drawings in this video i took like two hours combined so yeah that's that's a small amount of time and i had just every one, every every one drawing is two different hand poses, so it's also a thing. I didn't photograph my left hand that much. I just freaking mirrored my picture and I just drew it like that, because that's all you really need to do to get the left hand. You mirror your right hand. Um, yeah. All that said and done, this was a very useful experiment. I might do it again with other stuff like feet, because I still have problems with feet, but those are. A little bit different, like hands, you have so many poses you could put it in, like you could do one different finger. It sounds weird, but you make one little adjustment to your finger and it's an entirely different pose. And feet are a little bit less like that, but feet are still hard to draw in my opinion. And shoes then don't look like they have flattened feet in them. So, you know, I might do some other studies, this is the first study I'm really doing. Uh, if you have any suggestions for studies I should do, you think would improve my overall quality quality uh leave a comment in the comment section below or you know if you think it's fun to see me approach a different subject you have problems with do that too which i say like i'm an, a very good artist while well, i'm really not i'm just trying my best my dude um that's really all i have to say for this video i enjoy the uh, other drawings that are in this one because i have like half of the video left and i don't know what to say, so I'm just going to leave you with some music, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye. Uh,